Hey guys, Shaper1000 here. Today we're going to be reviewing these two lights. They're cheap lights from a cheap store. Stay tuned. <laughs> Okay guys, <coughs> today I'm going to be checking out a couple lights that Monkey found for me at a dollar store. One came from the Dollar Tree, and that's that one there, and one came from Family Dollar I think, or Dollar Store or whatever, and that's that one, it was, it was five dollars, we're going to check them out. Still not feeling real well, but I've been off work all week. I'm going to try to go back tomorrow. Uh, got bronchitis. So, anyway, let's check this out, guys. Okay, here's here's the first one here. This, this costs $5. And it, it is a name brand, though, from Bell Howe. I used to have a, a camera that was, uh, was also night vision from them, which was a decent camera but it was very expensive huh sound like a phone was buzzing it was a uh, expensive uh, um, camera but uh, with the problem I had with it was it, it would focus all the time for no reason you could have it on a tripod just like we got this one here and all at once it would just start focusing for no reason. But anyway, this is a it's a power series two and one COB LED work light. So um, three super bright or super bright three LEDs. It's 160 lumens in total. So it is also like a little flashlight or work light. It also has a swivel hook to hang it and. A magnetic mount so <coughs> it's got a magnet on the back but it does take three triple uh, a three of the small batteries we have right here so let's go ahead and open this up and see what's see what what's shaking here uh, I mean it's, it's just a light I know but we're gonna check it out for you and I'll let you know if it's worth the money before you go out and buy it. Okay. Uh, her phone must have been ringing. I, I thought I heard something buzzing. But yeah, I still got <coughs> bronchitis. Went to the doctor Monday. He put me off work till the uh, rest of the week. But I think I'm going to try to go in tomorrow. Maybe we'll see how I feel in the morning. Uh, I just like the instructions. See. Bell, Hal. I, you know, I'm not, you know, affiliated with them in any way. So, but it's it's kind of it's plastic, but it's kind of kind of rubbery. So it it feels like it's it is well made. Like I said, their camera, the camera that I had was well made, but uh, it just it focused all the time. There's the hook. It does swivel. And there's the magnet right there. Pretty cool. So let's get the batteries in. She's looking at me. She's walking around in her underwear. That's funny. I'm not telling the world. I'm just telling YouTube. <laughs> I don't have that many viewers. They don't care. Alright, so anyway, that's why I didn't get her on film, so, apparently you just push the button, oh, that is bright, and I'll show you here in the garage here in a minute how bright that is, push it again is off, and then push it again, and there's like the little flashlight deal, so, what, what, anyway, so let's go in the garage. And we'll shut off. And I'll shut. Oops. I was like, wow, there's still a lot of light coming in. 
just to get an idea. So now we'll take the light and we'll turn it on. So yeah, wow, it's pretty bright. Yeah. Now let's do the flashlight part of it. Come on, focus. I'm trying to get the uh, camera to focus. There it is. So yeah. Uh, not bad. Well, focus. Magnetic. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. So that one. Uh, so far, seems to be okay. Let's go back out here. So it seems to be, I don't know, about five dollars worth, but I guess it'd be it'd be handy to have put in your in your junk drawer at home or your toolbox, tackle box, whatever. I guess it'd be alright for that because it is very, very bright. Um, it does seem pretty durable. I mean, like I said, it's plastic. You don't want to go bang around too much, but if you drop it, I figure it'd be alright. And it does stick. Magnet sticks good, so there's that one. So Bell and Howe, five dollar light. This is the package it comes in. Um, I'm gonna say yeah. You know, five bucks. What the heck? I think for five bucks they should give you the batteries too. But I mean, you know, it is a name brand, so you're gonna pay a little more for it. So and uh, you know, we'll let you know how that does. I guess that'd be great for camping. It is it is bright. So. Yeah, I like it so far. Now we got this one. This thin flashlight. Look how thin it is. <laughs> this is kind of cool. So it's trying me so you know. It does already have the batteries in it, but they're non-replaceable. So once it goes dead, it's done. It's a done deal. Um, but there's something on here I noticed earlier. Then this one's from. <laughs> you guys should have seen that. She's out here wiggling her butt. She, uh, um, what was I saying? <laughs> she got me all. I can't remember what I, what I was talking about. But anyway, I've been wanting to do videos all week, but like I said, I haven't felt good. Yeah. Okay, this is cool. It's like. No. It's I don't know. See, can you see that? It's all like it's like a rubberish plastic type thing. It's just something. But what gets me is I seen on here. The first thing it says on here is magnetic. Then it says portable. Press and hold to activate. So you can't turn it on and then hang it on something. You know, you can't because you got to hold it. So I guess it's just to like stick on your fridge and you'll have it for an emergency. This was a dollar. So, I mean, is it worth a buck? I'd say, yeah, what the hell, you know, just have to, to stick on to, you know, stick on your fridge or throw it in your junk drawer or whatever. Just have for an emergency light, you know, throw it in your glove box, whatever. Um, you know, yeah, so, I mean... It is what it is. It's cute. Let's see what it looks like here in the dark. Alright, let me shut this light off again. Camera light. Well, I hope I can find it. There it is. Alright, so, let's see. Here we go. Here's the light. As we get there, it's focusing. On well, focus. There we go. So, yeah, I mean, I can see okay. I mean, for an emergency light, 
sure, whatever, right? <laughs> um, okay, so anyway, there's let's take it back out here. So there's that light, cute. Uh, for a dollar, yeah, it's worth it. Now, as far as waterproof, I know everybody's always talking about everything's got to be water. Is it waterproof? Is it waterproof? Is it waterproof? And that's usually coming from people that's never going to be outside in a rainstorm or anything like that. So, what's it really matter? I mean, is this waterproof? I mean, it seems to be sealed up pretty good. Let's see what it says here. If it is or not, it doesn't say. Uh, you know, for a dollar, who really cares? <laughs> but it's, it's it's got the uh, <coughs> it's a CR2032 it's a 2032 button cell battery which you can buy but it says right there non-replaceable <laughs> so but the battery I mean you know it would cost a hell of a lot more than just the whole damn flashlight but that seems to be sealed so I'm guessing that I mean, for a buck, let's try it, right? You want to try it? What? Let's throw it in some water. Does it say it's waterproof? No. <laughs> oh, it didn't. So no. it's probably not then. I, it's a dollar. I'm going to do it, guys. <laughs> Hang on, I'll be right back. Did you come and show how dark it was? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was dark. Okay, guys. We're back. Now we got some water here. You see that? Uh, should I turn this light on? Bring it down there a little bit. Maybe you can see something. Alright guys, here we go. Got a glass of water here and our light. Well, it actually floats. It floats? Yeah. Yeah, it does float. It is floating. I don't know, you gotta push the button and hold it, remember? But, anyway, I'm soaking it in there. I'm not even gonna wipe it off there. It's still working, so. Yeah, it's, it's, it's waterproof. So for a buck, yeah, what the hell, grab it and any emergency you know in any emergency it's not really really bright but I mean just to have throw it in your tackle box or whatever you need light real quick there it is you know so yeah I mean yeah is, is it worth a dollar hell yeah I say two thumbs up for this uh, this one I give it a thumbs up because you know like I said I think it, I think they shouldn't they, they should include the batteries for five bucks because it is this piece of plastic but I mean, it does seem to be durable and made well, so I'm going to say, yeah, it is worth $5. I just wish I'd give you batteries with it. And this one, yeah, hell yeah, it's worth a dollar. I don't know who makes it. I don't know what company it is. Uh, Greenbrier International. So that's that's the name of this one. It's Greenbrier. This is Bell & Howe. So, yeah, thumbs up for both of them. So that's pretty cool. So, anyway, thanks, monkey. Uh, she wanted to get me uh, something because I've been in the house. I ain't been outside. Like I said, I've been sick. I uh, didn't really have anything here in here to make a video on. I can make a, I got a couple to do on the truck. Stop it. I'm trying to film. <laughs> anyway, a uh, couple things I could have done outside, but I didn't want to be outside. Get myself worse. I'm trying to get better, so I don't know if I'll make it in. I'll see what I feel like in the morning. If I feel like I do right now, I'll try to go to work. If not, then I'm going to stay home and uh, do something else. So, anyway, there you go. Those two lights, Bell and Howe, and then the Green Briar. This one, that one, well worth a dollar. <laughs> what the hell, right? It's not really bright, but in a pinch, yeah. I mean, you know, keep it under your doormat. Hell, it's waterproof, and you come in late at night. There you go. You can see it unlock your house, whatever. It's worth it. Six bucks for them two lights. This one, like I say, does not come with batteries. It should, but yeah, it's worth it. Thumbs I got up. A discount so. on that. How'd you get a discount? Dollar General gives you discounts on your phone, so I tried it today. Yeah. And I got a dollar off as long as I bought a dollar oh five or more. You got a dollar off this. Yep. 
Okay, so she got a dollar off this, some kind of app on her phone or something? Um, you can just go to the Dollar General website and use their um, website. You don't, but they do have an app too you can use. Okay, well, we'll check that out. Yeah, it's cool. Uh, I just started Dollar Store. Uh, go to their website. What is it, Dollar General? Yeah. Dollar General. Go to their website. You can get discounts. So she gave four dollars for this one, and this one was the Dollar Tree, which was a dollar. So yeah, give it a shot, guys. Um, is it worth the money? Yeah, so far I think they are worth the money. Uh, I mean, what the heck, right? <laughs> Especially the dollar one. That thing is cute. It's kind of rubbery. Different. That could be funny. Yeah, it's cute as hell. So we'll keep it in our junk drawer because we'll, you know, or maybe I'll keep it in my toolbox. You know, sometimes you need a little light just to look in something real quick. So it's not the brightest, but it ain't meant to light up, you know. The whole, the whole town so there you go all right guys that being said i'm gonna say uh thanks again monkey you're welcome and say shea bear i'm gone for now uh, remember the myth the man the legend shea bear 1000 guys i'll talk to you guys soon have a good one bye bye now